Hello, Henry from Belgium here. Today, I show you my latest find. It's LEGO Set 386 Air Ambulance from 1976. So keep watching the video. The set has the theme, Legoland. It consists of 151 pieces and three minifigs. I found this box at a flea market. The nice condition of the box surprised me because the set is over 40 years old. Beautiful colors, no sticker marks. Here and there a dent or a crease, but that is unavoidable. On the back are examples of alternative buildings. You can also build an airplane or a hovercraft with the same set. This box slides open when you push on the side. The inlay also looks pretty too, only a few little cracks. I see that the manual is also included, but the condition is unfortunately not that great. To begin with, it is folded in half, which I always find very unfortunate. And the explanation is simple. The manual does not fit in the inlay without folding it, because of these sides. It is actually the intention to first slide the cover of the box over the inlay, and then slide the manual in between without folding, but most people don't do that. So unfolded manuals in such sets are very rare, valuable, and hard to find. I also see a tear here and here's some restoration work with tape. Finally, I always find it good that there are printed images of the alternative buildings. But a pity that there are no instructions in detail. This is quite difficult for a child of 6 to build it correctly. But despite the condition, I am always very satisfied when the box and manual are included, because that makes it unique and worth including the set in my collection. Let's look at the set. The bricks are mixed up in the box. So I'm not sure if the set is complete. This I will find out today. I will start building the ambulance car and the minifigs. White bricks for the bodywork. And transparent bricks for the windows. This is a nice brick. It is not a sticker, but a print. These stickers are a nice accent, but I don't like the way they are attached. They are pasted over five different bricks. If you want to make alternative builds, this cannot be done without damaging the stickers. When you break open the roof, you can place a minifig in it. At the back it can be a bit easier by opening the doors. The minifigs are the classic ones from that time, with no facial expression or limbs. But nice that there are three included. That is always an added value for a set. I think it is, given the period, a good design. Basic, but good, with some well-chosen accents and colorful stickers. Now I'm going to build the helicopter. This requires a little more work, because it is of course the main element in this set. Here also mainly white and transparent bricks. But a lot of red too. The bricks are basic and the design is easy to build. I like these bricks, especially considering the period. It is a slope 45, 2x2 two two double concave. I also like these bricks for the finish. Finally, the propeller. The color fits well as a contrast against the rest. In later sets, helicopters often have only two blades. These are really impressive. I enjoyed building this helicopter. Beautiful and imposing model, with well-chosen colors. 
Lots of space inside for minifigs or accessories. Again bricks with a print, but also bricks with stickers. And unfortunately also some attached again over different bricks. When I go to look up the original sticker sheet, I notice that I don't have them all. Unfortunately a few are missing. But in terms of bricks, the set is complete. A nice addition to my collection. Two beautiful vehicles, three minifigs, and complete with box and manual. Feel free to write down your comments under this video. You can also like and subscribe. It's free. Thanks for watching and until the next video.